Kathy, let's wait for people to join. We will start recording after six. We can start recording. Okay. Good evening, everyone. How are you? Can I have uh, the regular high five? High five, everyone. How are you? How are you? Okay, Kanada Sensei. Hi. Okay, high five. High five. Okay. Um, okay. A lot of you um, must be uh, in track with what we have been learning in the last uh, class. So we uh, started off with articles and prepositions, right? So we are going to uh, continue articles and prepositions. But just that today, I have planned to do something different. We will uh, go through the PPT for article and prepositions. And then I have six games, okay, for us to practice, okay? So we will start with the PPT and then we'll quickly move on to the games, okay? The PPT is just for introducing you to the concept. You will learn through practice when we try the games, okay? Okay, is that okay? Is that okay? Is everyone in agreement with that? Can I have a response, please? You can say yes, thumbs up. There are a lot. Okay, agreed. Okay, sir. Sayed has agreed. Okay, fine. So today we are going to get into a quick look into what is an article. Okay, yesterday I introduced you to the concept of A, and and D. Okay. So we said uh, these are the three articles and they are used for different reasons in different uh, 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 places, right? We said A and an are usually used in front of a singular noun, whereas the is used when, when it is in front of a noun, uh, usually a name, place or a thing, right? So this is uh, the quick review of yesterday. We also learned how and when to use a or an and what are the exceptions, right? Can someone tell me what is the exception uh, while using an? Does, uh, do all vowels have an in front of them? Do all vowels have an in front of them? Is there any vowel that will not have an? Is there any vowel that will not have an? Is there any vowel that will not have an in front of it? Respond, please. You can say yes or no, or you can type if there is any vowel that will not have an in front of it. Sayad, guide three, please participate. Okay. There is one. Um, a vowel that does not have article in front of it, which is the vowel U. Okay. So we also learned how to use the Tamil alphabets to identify whether to use an in front of a particular word or not, a particular noun or not. Right. Uh, you can you can check uh, the recordings in the Open Mentor website. The earlier recordings are present uh, in the Open Mentor site for you to refer. Right. Okay. So now when we talk of uh, articles, we said uh, articles are used with nouns, right? Countable nouns, bottle, apple, pencil, chair, cat, right? So I said uh, um, it is used predominantly with nouns. So see, the, the idea here is uh, if you have noun, you have to say whether you are using a singular, uh, uh, whether you are referring to a singular noun or plural noun. Same way, you have to say whether you are referring to uh, a definite article or indefinite article. I'll come to what it means. Okay, uh, right now, I just want you to understand articles are of two types, definite and indefinite. We will learn what they are, okay? So, definite article is the, okay? It, it comes only when uh, you refer to a specific definite thing. There is no plural in it. It is not uh, 
are red. It is very clear. The blue dog. Blue color la irukra dog. That is definite one thing to say. That is a pointed reference. Okay. The black cat. The boy in the last bench. Right. The chair. The girl who is tall. Right. So, in the Madri, definite article refers to singular objects which are pointed. That is definite identify. It is mostly used with definition. Right. That's that's where the word definite comes. The scatter, the scattering of uh, uh -huh. the Raleigh's law of scattering refers to the C. V. Raman effect defines that, right? We define the light year as right. So whenever you are talking to the you are using the, it is a definite article where you say. You are talking about a very particular object, right? There can be uh, the, the advantage of using the or the, the extension of the is that it can be used with both singular nouns and plural nouns, whereas a and an cannot be used with plural nouns. The blue dog, the dogs, the can come when you are referring to a single person or multiple people. On the other hand, a and an will come only with singular people. A dog, an apple, a boy, a girl, an umbrella. Right? So that is the main difference. Right? There are two types of articles. One is definite article, which is the, and then you have indefinite articles, which is a and an. Okay. Definite article the can be used with singular and plural nouns, and it, it is used to refer to a pointed noun. Okay. Clear so far? Am I fast? Should I repeat? Is it clear so far? Can I have thumbs up? I need you to interact. Is it clear till now? Okay. Fine. Right. So now, indefinite article. When we take indefinite article, there are two indefinite articles. One is A and the other one is A. A is used in front of consonants or <coughs> words uh, that starts with the consonant sound. And is used in front of vowels or words that starts with the vowel sound. Okay. So, uh, for uh, more uh, uh, generic uh, reference to this, you can refer to yesterday's session video. Always A and an are used only with singular objects. Okay. Singular object na unu la ore or item pati solumbod. Okay. A dog, an elephant, a chair, a boy. Right. So um when you can think of uh, A and an like this. Apala on the one item pati solromo. Or a dog, or a or a house, right? Apri solre at the law, A illa an work, a dog, a house. Uh, an umbrella, right? So, whenever you are first mentioning uh, something in a sentence, or a sentence, if you are referring to a noun, right? You say, a boy ran on the road. The boy got hurt. So, I told you, a butterfly landed on my dog's nose. The butterfly was pink. So, whenever you are referring to a noun at the start of a sentence, usually, you use A or A. Okay. Is this clear? Am I fast? Is this clear? Is this clear? Any questions? Any questions? Okay. Okay. Fine. Yesterday, we saw that there are situations where we will not use article. So, whenever we uh, we see that, you know, uh, you are talking about uh, non-countable nouns, right? Uh, the count Okay. You cannot, uh, see, if you say boxes, you can say how many. If you say houses, you can say how many. If you say pigs, you can say how many. If you say boys, you can say how many. If you say girls, you can say how many, right? And the madri count panna 
முடியாதது இருக்கு சிலது ஹாப்பினஸ் ஹார்மனி சேட்னஸ் ஐரனி பியர் ஜஸ்டிஸ் சோ இந்த மாதிரி அப்ட்ராக்டிங்ஸ் விச் யூ கேனாட் கவுண்ட் தேர் யூ வில் நாட் யூஸ் டெபினட் ஆர்டிகல் ஓகே ரைட் சோ டெபினட் ஆர்டிகல் கேன் பி used in a sentence where that particular uh, word is used for example the sadness she felt at his passing so the sentence start can have okay we don't use indefinite articles uh, directly with non countable nouns okay right so um, we can we can use definite articles right uh for example um uh, with uh okay let me let me come around it you cannot use a uh, and an the indefinite articles with words like happiness harmony sadness etc you can only use the that is first part the second part is whenever you are talking about quantities or measurements right then we cannot use a or an okay we can just say the brown dirt the cold water right uh, the 100 kg sugar the big cake okay so whenever we talk of uh, articles we do not use them in front of non countable nouns especially a and an a and an no, always it refers to one thing or one person or one noun the ref- can refer to multiple people or a single noun a pointed noun right they can, a and an cannot be used with ab- abstract things like happiness harmony sad nama namlaala kannula kannukku theriyadathu measure panna mudiyadathu right adala vandu panna mudiyadhu you cannot use a and an okay you don't say a love i have for her you say the love i have for her right right so um, these are the cases where you cannot use articles okay is this clear is this clear um am i clear uh, are there any questions is it clear if you have questions you have to raise your hands if you don't have questions you have to provide confirmation either in the chat box or give me a thumbs up any questions shall i proceed okay fine so next see uh, some examples i have you can say you cannot say i am the happy you can just say i am happy and when we talk of a uh, very specific count one right give me you cannot say give me a bottle you say give me a glass of water right on the other hand when you are referring to the entire uh, group right the entire water you can say the water is cold right and whenever you are referring to a single uh, uh, pronoun right i am happy to see the sushi no i am happy to see sushi right so these are some examples of how we should not use articles however like we discussed yesterday there are a lot of exceptions in articles okay. for example understanding understanding okay you always say we can we came to an understanding right and if the if the name or the noun refers to a location right then we can use the the united states of america the university of houston the the writing center right and if if there are certain uh, uh, names that are attributed to countable nouns okay um for example if you say uh, chennai right the chennai i knew is very hot the entire place is called chennai it is a single name for the entire uh, for that one state sorry for that one district right so uh, the chennai i knew 
uh, was very hot right where you are uh, using the in the place of place and you can also say if you have uh, a fight with your friend and uh, he is behaving differently you say right ennoda surya vaadu abdin kekkala adha mari the surya i know does not behave like this whenever you are referring to a single name that is describing a countable noun adhu adu direct ah countable noun ah irukada ana and per vandu ore or aalayo ore or edathayo denote pannu andha mari nerathai you can use the இதெல்லாம் சொல்லிட்டோம் இப்போ ஆனா வந்து நவ் ஐ வாண்ட் அஸ் டு கெட் சம் கிளாரிட்டி வென் ஐம் ரைட்டிங் ஐ கே நாட் திங்க் சோ மச் ரைட் ஐ நீட் சம் கிளாரிட்டி ஹவு டு ஐ டிசைட் ரைட் தெர் ஆர் சம் ஈஸி ஸ்டெப்ஸ் ஓகே ஃபர்ஸ்ட் திங் இஸ் டு லுக் அட் த நவ் இஸ் இட் கவுண்டபிள் ஆர் நாட் கவுண்டபிள் ரைட் சோ லெட் அஸ் சே வி ஹாவ் அ சென்டென்ஸ் ரைட் ஐ வாண்ட் டு டிஸ்கிரைப் அ கேட் cat is a countable noun cat means one cat okay so we can use a if it is uh, uh, not a vowel or we can use an since it is not a vowel we say i want to describe a cat the second step is to decide if it is the first time you are referring to that noun or if it is the second time right so if that is the case then you can use the article. the third step is to say are you very specific about that noun or is that noun a, a very general thing right you can uh, for example i am talking about a specific cat i am talking uh, talking about the red cat right whenever you are specific you can use the article four so whenever you are describing your noun already and the noun on the previous sentence le introduce panitom but we are describing that noun right and in that case you can use the okay for example i have a black cat now you have introduced black cat in the first sentence in the second sentence you are going to describe what the cat did so you are going to say the cat chased the gray mouse right you can also say i saw a cat chase a mouse today this is more generic okay so with that we come to uh, the end of articles so in this uh, set of topics i have covered where, when to use articles what are the different types of articles when not to use articles okay we learned that there are three articles a and and they and uh, sorry a and and the and uh, we learned that uh, 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 articles are of two types de- definite and indefinite articles the is a definite article because it refers to a definite pointed specific noun it can be used with singular noun and plural nouns on the other hand a and an or indefinite articles they can be used only with a singular noun that is any time you are referring to a single person or a single place or a single item that is where you can use a and that if the word has vowel sound you use an if the word has uh, non vowel sound you use a right and uh, there are situations where uh, there are uh, uh, things which you should take care of when you are using an uh, a and the the first thing is to check what type of noun it is is it a single countable noun or is it a non countable noun if it is a non countable abstract thing like happiness sad anger victory winning smile love in all those cases you you cannot use uh, a or an okay so on uh, the second thing is to check whether you are referring to that particular noun for the first time or for a, or is it a continuation of a previous sentence okay and the third thing is you should also be careful in referring to whether your your noun refers to a single entity or is it a general noun so with all this you can easily correct the way you uh, use articles in your sentence okay is it clear till now is it clear can we proceed with the exercise okay uh, i have uh, three exercise for articles today okay 
we will start with the exercise on articles and then we'll proceed with propositions okay the first uh, uh, i'm pasting all the three links take one exercise at a time and please complete it once you are done with the exercises please let me know okay i'm i'm posting the first link here also opening it on my screen so that you can see the link is in the QA box. Please open the link and start playing. You have uh, a seven questions uh, test. Okay, you have a, a timer there. So please make sure that you are uh, playing the game. This would be a good practice. Have you started the game? Can I have thumbs up? Have you started the game? Are you able to access the link? Folks, please respond. Are you able to access the link? Pa, link click on the Okay, once you are done with the game, please ping me so that we can proceed with the other game. I will need volunteers to answer this. we done can we proceed to the next exercise is it complete have we completed the exercise have we completed the exercise who wants to volunteer an answer please raise your hand Please raise, uh, raise your hand. I want a volunteer. Quickly. Quickly. Who can answer this for me? There is no right or wrong. I just want you to volunteer. Volunteer, please raise your hand. I want one person to help and solve this for me. Please raise your hands. Gayatri, Sayas. Yeah. Uh, okay. Saravanan. Saravanan, I'm unmuting you. Please help me to solve this. Saravanan, Petri, Appa. Saravanan. Saravanan, am I audible to you? Okay, if Saravanan is not able to speak, uh, can I have more uh, uh, volunteers, please? Saravanan, are you able to speak? Gayatri, Sayad. Okay, I'm going to give a chance to someone in random. Okay, hmm. let me see. Uh, Kamalesh, Kamalesh. Kamalesh, can you talk? Kamalesh? Kamalesh? Kanadasan? Guys, don't waste time. Please raise your hand. I want a volunteer. We cannot move without discussing the answer. Please raise your hand. If you are not going to participate, you have to at least tell me I am not in a position to talk. Right? So that I can give chance to people who want to talk. Nivedita, do you want to talk? Nivedita? 
நிவேதிதா கேக்குதாமா are there no volunteers nobody wants to learn folks please respond folks no i don't want thumbs up i want some volunteer to solve the exam yes finally mother madan please talk madan kekuda pa madan yes ma'am ah kekuda ma ah kekuda okay can we solve this screen therida ah okay ma'am okay ma'am ah sollu pa edu pa answer delhi is a dash capital of india ரைட் ராங் பத்தி கவலைப்படாத ஜஸ்ட் ரைட் ஏவா ஆனா தேவா ஏவா ஆமா மேம் சரி நான் ஆன்சர் எடுத்துக்கிறதுக்கு முன்னாடி நான் உனக்கு 2 क्वेश्चंस கேப்பேன் ஓகே அதுக்கு அதுக்கு நீ ஆன்சர் பண்ணிட்டு அதுக்கு அப்புறமா எது கரெக்ட்டான ஆப்ஷன்னு சொல்லு சரியா ஓகே மேம் இஸ் டெல்லி ரெஃபரிங் டு a singular noun டெல்லின்றது ஒரு ஒரு நவுனா ஒரே ஒரு பொருளை பத்தி குறிக்கிறதா டெல்லி இல்ல மேம் ஆன் ஆன் இருடா அவசரப்படாதா டெல்லி இஸ் டாஷ் கேபிட்டல் ஆஃப் இந்தியா ஓகே சரி நம்ம டெல்லியை விட்டுருவோம் கேபிட்டல் ஆஃப் இந்தியான்றது ஒரு ஒரு விஷயமா இல்ல நிறைய விஷயமா இஸ் இட் சிங்கிள் சிங்குலர் நவுன் ஆர் குரூப் நிறைய விஷயம் மேம் capital of india nradhu delhi mattum thana amma va illaya amma ma'am delhi nradhu ori edam correct ah amma ma'am so nama enna solli irukom if you are referring to a definite noun adhaadu ore ore edatha correct kurippa sollanum appadina you have to use the okay ore porula sollanum ore ore porul ore apple ore india ore indian அப்படி சொல்லணும்னா சர்பிரைஸ் ஆ மதன் எஸ் மேம் சொல்லுமா ட்ரை பண்ண we have dash surprise for you the surprise னு சொல்ல முடியாது ஏனா வந்து surprise surprise we have a... ஆ good we have a surprise for you ஏனா ஒரு surprise பத்தி பேசுறோம் ரைட்டா so we okay. have a surprise for you very good okay i heard dash interesting story yesterday so story in irukku so appo oru noun da right ah so okay, you know, focus panna interesting story in irukku ena varanum ena varalam her the nee enak choice theriya i heard ஐ வந்து வவல் கரெக்ட்டா வவல் தானே வவல் முன்னாடி என்ன வரலாம் அ வரணுமா அன் வரணுமா அன் வெரி குட் சோ தி ஆன்சர் இஸ் ஐ ஹேர்ட் அன் இன்ட்ரஸ்டிங் ஸ்டோரி எஸ்டர்டே ஓகே நெக்ஸ்ட் ஐ ஜஸ்ட் பாட் டாஷ் பிக் பாக்ஸ் ஆஃப் குக்கீஸ் ஒரு பாக்ஸ் ஆஃப் குக்கி வாங்கியிருக்கேன் இது வந்து வவல் கிடையாது அப்ப என்ன வரணும் ஏவா ஆனா தேவா மதன் நெக்ஸ்ட் டிட் யூ சி டேஷ் கிரிக்கெட் மேட்ச் எஸ்டர்டே 
இது வந்து நேத்தோட மேட்ச் ஒரு ஸ்பெசிபிக் நவு அப்ப என்ன வரணும் என்ன வரணும் நேத்துக்ட் <laughs> What is dash name of your dog? One or two, Kuripa or two, I forget. Can you remember? What is them? Super. Okay. Last one. Do you like dash indoor or outdoor? Indoor or outdoor? I forget. Yeah, ma'am. Die, die. Can you try it? In here, too. Do you like? dash indoors or the outdoors specific ana or edutha like the indoor ma'am ah very good da super okay so pa nama submit panuvom okay ella answers submit pannatoma okay fine okay ipo and leader board la yaar irukka nu paapom let us see who is in the leader board okay uh vedan aruna k okay there are uh, some people uh, for us also okay nanda panirka shalini panirka vignesh panirka okay so um, uh, those who made it to the leader board very good madan thank you so much da keep participating in the session okay okay okay, okay. so we'll go to the next game i have uh, another game please do not waste time uh, finish the game quickly and uh, volunteer immediately to discuss ninga volunteer pandradhilendu someone might learn okay so i am just putting the second game link potrken please open second games link please open the link it is a grouping uh, uh, exercise So, इधर एंडेंस सेंटेंस क्लांग ए वर्मो इंगे ऐड से बैकनो एंडेंस सेंटेंस क्लांग एन वर्मो इंगे बैकनो इंगलां द वर्मो इंगे बैकनो एंडेंस सेंटेंस क्लांग आर्टिकल नहीं लायो नो आर्टिकल लग कुन्दे बैकनो ओके सो लेट अस लेट अस क्विकली फिनिश इट फिनिश पाइंट इट सोलंगा ओरने कमान कमान मेक इट फास्ट इट इस एन So you have completed. Please intimate uh, to me in the Q A box. Saroja, Shalini, uh, please uh, Priya, please try to participate and uh, help us to resolve the question. Finish the game and tell me. Make it fast.
have you completed who has completed who wants to help us is it over or is it difficult if it is difficult we can do it together i just need two volunteers two volunteers please two volunteers who want to learn and who also wants to help others to learn if you have not completed that's okay we can learn together we can discuss and learn folks folks we are running out of time we have one more game also please raise your hand can someone please uh, volunteer i need volunteers without volunteers i cannot proceed have you completed has anyone completed anyone who has completed please type a yes or show me a thumbs up okay i'll wait for one more minute Okay, anyone who has completed, time up. If it is difficult, we will do it uh, together. Who wants to try? Folks, please respond. Please respond. Please raise your hand. We are wasting a lot of time in delaying uh, to respond. Saroja, do you want to try? Saroja, are you there? Folks, Sayed, Swarna, do you want to try? There is no right or wrong. Let us try. I just want a volunteer who is willing to try. Please raise your hand if you are willing to try. Okay, someone uh, says... Okay, nobody has completed it. Is it difficult? Can you give me a thumbs up if it is difficult? Are you able to access? Okay, it is difficult. Okay, let us try. Uh, who wants to volunteer? Let us try this game. Who wants to volunteer? Shalini? Shalini, shall I unmute you? Okay, I'm going to ask Saroja to do it. Saroja and Saroja can have company. Uh, let me see if we can get. Saroja, Kekdama. Okay, Saroja, can you help me? Okay. Mm, I will also request Nanda. Nanda. Saroja, are you able to hear me, Saroja? Hello, Saro. Saroja. Okay. Nanda, can you hear me? 
Folks, ah, yes, please talk. Ah, Nanda, can you do that? Ah, yes, ma'am. Audible, ma'am. Ah, okay. Can we try? Okay, ma'am. Okay. So first in the sentence, padikla. He is a dash real gentleman. Id idla porla. Eva, Anna, Dava, no article. Ah, uh, yella porla, ma'am. Good. He is a real gentleman. Okay. That's good. Move. Okay. Dash Swedish is a difficult language to learn. Thing there is no article. Okay. Good. Da. Very good. Okay. I am crazy about reading dash history books. Sir, we will come to that later. He is dash yes. engineer. And bola ma'am. Super. Dash dress she is wearing is blue. The dress. Okay. I have dash idea. Let's go bowling. I have an idea. Super. Okay. I bought dash umbrella to go out in the rain. An umbrella. Super. Very good. Okay. This is dash exception. This is uh, and or no? And very good. Super. Dash apple a day keeps the doctor away. The example mm. could have solid can. An apple and uh, an apple a day doctor away. Okay. Our neighbors have dash cat and dash dog. The cat die. I have an as have a cat and a dog. Please give me dash cake that is on the counter. Specific cake ground. Counter maler cake a kudun. A pedwarla. Very good. My daughter is learning to play dash violin at her school. The violin. Okay. Next. I have borrowed dash money from her before. A Nanigan. Ah, sir, we'll come to that later. Okay. I borrowed dash pencil from your pile of pencils and pen. Borrowed a yeah, pencil. Ah, a pencil. Yeah, na, or pencil, pati sold. I like to play dash basketball. And there is no article. Okay, let me see. Okay. Dash General's army attacked the city at the night. Sorry, at night. Uh, the generals. Yeah. I bought Dash new TV set yesterday. I bought, yeah. Okay. I have, okay. My first apartment was on Dash Orange Street. Sound street. Uh, don't know where. Street in the or particular Teru Pati Solo specific. These street are now. Okay. okay, we have two questions that we are on doubt. My parents gave me dash basketball for my birthday. Give me a basketball. Super. On the A and N side, we have no doubts. Ingada on your doubt. I am crazy about reading dash history books. In a Kandipa article, Irkanma. Okay, so no article. She is dash prettiest girl in the school. So, so this is the She is the prettiest girl in the school. Last I have borrowed money. Sorry, dash money from her before. Did the article varnu ma kandi pa? Ah, I want that one. Okay, fine. Let us see. A full la correct and full la correct. A super da. High five. Thank you, ma'am. Super da. Okay. 
did uh, did everyone learn uh, can i have a quick uh, thumbs up did everyone learn okay nanda okay someone says thank you then okay rudra okay vigneshwaran hey nama aalaga yaarume mudikliyada okay and uh, now that you have heard it i want you to retry it again you can copy this links uh, and keep it with you you can retry it again seriya okay nanda thank you da good 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 thank job you. okay so we are going to go with the last game okay for articles after this we have to do propositions so for article this is the last game putting the link in the qa box i am also opening it last game folks please start this game is little simple this is a simple game hit the moles that are correct edilala vandu correct a article and the word ku etha mari irko you should just click on that okay a uh, 1 rupee note and the mari okay okay so i want you to try okay we'll take one full minute if you have completed you just say yes please start please start in one minute we will uh, we will discuss the answer okay please uh, proceed if you have completed please ping me Okay, have we have we completed? Has anyone completed? Please give me a thumbs up if you have completed. Who wants to discuss the answer with me? please raise your hands has anyone completed please please ping me if you have completed is the link accessible are you able to access the link
folks please respond are you able to do it is it taking more time what happened why nobody is responding customer ka give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down if it is difficult give a thumbs down we will go for discussion See, I am not able to see you. So, if uh, only you interact, I will know what to do next in the class. Sayed, have you completed? Sayed, mudshti apa? Okay, ma'am, I am in level six. Okay, okay, it is a long level, ah. Huh? Okay, there are ten levels in total, is it? Okay, Charlie is in level six. Okay, anyone who wants to help, let's get started. I am going to ask uh, Sayed to help me this time. Sayed, idki apa? Sayed, I am unmuting you. Sayed, ma'am. Can we try? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so let us start. The sun, the, the Ramana, Ramana, the the sun and MLA. Hey, sorry, pa. Ah, and MLA, ayo, kappa. Ah, the best. Ir maer ma. Aad tis varto. Mu na a one rupee note por lama. Ah, a one rupee note. Ah, a European na illa. Ailum. An MLA, wa. An MLA. Ah, okay. Al kapro. Ah. Level two. The sun, na. The sun. Ah, the Ramayana. Ah, okay. An honorable, An honorable man. man. The best. The best. Okay. A useful metal. Ah. A one rupee note. Ah. An uncle, the best, ah. an aunt. Ida ida. The level more than this. Okay. Level three. We will go up to level six. Okay. A useful metal. The A Ramana. useful metal. The Raman. Ah. The Bible. The an uncle. A boy. Ah. ah. An infant. Ah. An aunt, a one rupee note, a ah. boy, ah. the Bible dozen, ah. an uncle. Okay, level three over. Okay. Okay, level four. The best ada. The best, the son, a boy, an honorable man, a. A bird, ah, an honorable man, ah, an unicorn, an unicorn, hey, ah, okay. an honorable man, hey, ah, uh, an aunt, okay, ah, a year, the Delhi, the Delhi lada, an uncle, an uncle, a year, an Emily, ni solita, the Bible. Milkada, a milkada, milk. Ah, what are Banda Bible? The Bible, okay. Super, we will put one top. Okay, so there are a lot of people who have played it before. Nanda, super da. Shalini, super. Vigneshwaran, Abdul SK, Malini, super. Pa. Is order Satan, I'm a Sayed Perim Bodaga. Okay, okay, Sayed, thank you, da, super. Hey, raise your hand when I'm asking you to participate. Purida. Okay. So today we have uh, learned about articles. Sariya, is everyone clear with articles? Do you have any feedback or anything that you want me to cover? Is everyone clear with articles? 
Is everyone clear? Folks, please respond. Please give me a thumbs up. Okay, fine. Right. So I will just introduce the concept of prepositions today. I'll just introduce. Okay, I'll just take 5-10 minutes because you're sitting from 6 o'clock without break. I don't want to extend it. I'll just take 5 minutes. I'll introduce you to the concept of prepositions and then I'll, I'll leave you. Okay, we will discuss it in detail tomorrow. Okay. See, articles are a way in which you emphasize on nouns. Okay. Ade mari preposition vandu enna pannu apdina. Preposition vandu and the word liye irukla preposition. Okay. It, it uh, tells uh, a lot about the position of uh, uh, the noun in your sentence. Okay. It can be with respect to place. It can be with respect to time. Uh, it can be with respect to the way your noun moves. Right. So, a uh, preposition refers to the preposition of the noun. Okay. So, for example, it can be with respect to uh, the place. Timothy sat on the raft. Syed went into the school. Right. So, Nanda uh, is sitting under the table. Right. And the Madri, it may refer to where your noun is. There are different uh, ways in which preposition uh, can occur. Okay. The most commonly used prepositions are of, uh, to, in, for, with, on, itala. Okay. We will learn how these prepositions are used. And we have three wonderful games that we are going to play also. Okay. So we will learn uh, the common list of prepositions. We will learn the different types of prepositions. There are three types of prepositions. Right. I'm going to introduce you to some beautiful games and also a preposition song. Okay. So we are going to enjoy the preposition session. I want everyone to try these at home. Take a, take a small uh, a paragraph from your textbook or from your, uh, you know, uh, uh, message in phone or news from the phone. Right. Okay. So, you have to uh, make sure that you practice this. Right? Okay. So, I am just stopping the class today. Uh, please share your feedbacks in the QA box. Please let me know if I am at the right speed and right delivery. If I am fast, please let me know so that I can adjust my speed accordingly. Okay? Uh, also, let me know what we can add to these sessions to make these sessions more useful for you. The only request from my side is you cannot learn soft skills without talking. You have to learn soft skills. You have to talk. Okay. Any questions? Any questions so far? Any questions? Okay. Fine. Uh, have a good day. Thank you so much. Keep practicing. We will meet again tomorrow. Okay.